I'm sorry. You will not touch me until after our wedding. This is a story of a Christian girl who was about to get married. Now, the worst happened a night before the wedding. Her best friend was with her all through the whole preparation and everybody got so, so tired and they decided to, you know, to sleep so that they will wake up early and continue the day. Not knowing that her friend has been jealous of her newfound love. See, this is exactly what happened that night. She tried all that she could, trying to lure the man to herself, fantasizing, making the man to fall for her. But I thank God this man is indeed a great man. But let's keep watching. Now she starts telling the man exactly what she wants. The man keep avoiding her. And she never sees. She keep pushing. Oh my God! Did you see? And this man finally see what she have been longing to have. That somebody is willing to give it for free. Oh my God! Did you say that? Being with a woman for some time, call uh, during the courtship and not be able to touch her even once. Now, he see the opportunity to get a free knack. But really, what kind of friend is this? Guys, please, as you're watching this video, keep sharing this video, keep sharing this video. What kind of friend is this? Somebody that you trust in. I pray that it will not happen what she wants. But what? Oh my god, now they have teamed up to push her out of the bed because she was really exhausted. That she dozed off without knowing what is happening around her. We could work. Oh my god, it finally happened. It finally happened. No, this is the end. Oh no. Indeed, human beings are selfish in nature. There's no love anymore. You that is watching this video, let's hear from you. What is your thought in the comment section? Drop it. And thank you for watching. See you in my next video.